Hello my friends of Hatari Labs, my name is Ormontoya Montoya and this opportunity we are going to do a quick tutorial about how to calculate an NDVI from, uh, from Sentinel-2 image okay? and this is a very basic tutorial um, and it's quite quick, quite simple if you follow the, if you follow the instructions okay? first of all we have downloaded the specific granule from ESA Satellite-2 satellite so, and those specific granules are banned are these bands are band uh, this is band blue band green band red and band infrared so if we okay so we have here how many sentinel bands have so the, we have band blue band green band red and band infrared so the NDVI is actually the, an in vegetation index NDVI yeah then and is calculated from a formula related to near infrared and red. Okay, so the formula is band the near the near infrared band uh, versus minus the red in and divided in the near infrared and the plus the red. Okay, cool. So let me oop, 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 oop. okay cool. let me show you maybe this is where the V's this is the visible infrared visible infrared is red okay yep because here is a V's visible <laughs> nobody yep okay so what what do we do uh we go to f we have a qas we create a new project we discard this and we are going to since we we want just the near infrared and the visible infrared i mean the red so we are going to use this the band 8 and band 4 only those ones yep cool so here we have band infrared and the red band okay so we go to raster and we go to raster calculation okay raster calculator this is a well, raster raster calculator is an algebra of rasters yeah where you can do many operations and this is very simple operation that we are going to do uh, we might create a we might create a a tutorial about how to use conditions because there is an interesting way how of using conditions in QA in on the raster calculator. Okay, so the formula say that is the near infrared min minus the red. Okay, so it's this is the near infrared. Ah, okay. First of all, I open parentheses. I say near infrared minus the red. I close parenthesis divided by the sum of I open parenthesis again infrared plus red okay cool that's that's it near infrared minus red divided by near infrared plus red and then I create a geotiff here and the geotiff here will be here I say that is NDVI okay uh, okay I strongly suggest that you download your own bands and then you do this this tutorial because um, I would like to to give you this band but there are 300 megas and it's not it's not purpose to, to upload and download this to you okay so what else do we have nothing else and then we create and those the sentinel two bands come actually in UTM so we wait because it's a little bit the process is a little bit um, longer or computing intensive okay uh, we take advance of this situation just to present that we are Hatari Labs and Hatari Labs is a blog dedicated in knowledge sharing on open source software 
for water resources, okay? We, we are a blog that we promote the use of open source software for many, for many applications, mostly on water resources or for environmental issues or any other thing that you might consider. Okay, we will uh, be uploading a lot of things in QAS, KKHMS, Modflow, OpenFOAM and so on. So please fo follow us and you can follow us by our newsletter. You can follow us by our social network, our Facebook profile and our Twitter account. And you can, if you want to, to send us a question, just use the contact form. That is a form that we, we review it and we actually answer it. Okay. And you can sign up to this YouTube channel as well, because in this channel we are going to 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 upload many other tutorials. So if you want to get in touch of the tutorials that we will be developing, please sign up to this uh, YouTube channel. Okay. Let's see. Okay, cool. So this is actually the NDVI, and then you see that NDVI is kind of very <laughs> the NDVI is kind of very I mean it's not user friendly so if we, we want to do it as user friendly so we say uh, we will we can do this so we say properties and from single band grade single band pseudo color and here I wanted to do it uh, for example this one okay so everything that is minus minus uh, and minus ndvi is actually um, um what is minus ndvi is actually glaciers and lakes okay and then you have um, this is almost bare soil and this is some wetlands and some valleys okay so we put apply okay and this is okay so here we have the glaciers and the lakes as minus and then here we have the bare soil and then on the green we have the valleys and irrigated areas uh, or wetlands and so okay cool that was really fun and and then this is actually a file that is called that is a t file i guess yep this is a t file and then you can use this NDVI to assess evaporate, uh, to assess vegetation development and droughts and urban development and so on. Okay. On the next tutorial, what what we are do is that we are going to do we are going to cut, yeah. Uh, we are going to cut a sentinel at this this image because and then we are going to do contours. Okay. So um, in order to do this uh, we hope to see you in another tutorial okay see you and hope to that you have a great day bye bye